What's going on you guys? It is your boy Spiritual King 369 in the building. I hope you guys are having a blessed day as always. Today what we're gonna be talking about is a dream. So let me tell you about this, y'all. So there's this saying in the Bible, you know, that the, the devil comes as a roaring lion, okay? Now that roaring lion could be very strong temptations. It can be just, you know, him, he's he's roaring loud. The devil always roars the loudest before he leaves. But I had a dream that a, a lion ran up on me. And I just, I, I just thought of Daniel, the story of Daniel in the lion's den. And how Daniel was thrown in the lion's den. But instead of them attacking him, they stopped and... They actually showed love to Daniel. They were just like, okay, like respect. You know, lions, they don't wanna, they don't wanna destroy things, or no, no, they don't wanna hunt animals or, you know, humans, especially if they're not running, if they're not scared. What's the point of it? They wanna earn it, you know what I mean? That's how lions work. And then I also, the night the night before this dream, I, 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 I was listening to this video, and in this video, this dude was talking about that lions, 90% of lion attacks are, like, usually when people run or whatever. They don't really attack when, you know, people are standing up for themselves or when something stands their ground. So, you know, that's how you got to be. You got to stand your ground all the time. The devil is not gonna freaking touch you if you stand your ground but if you show fear you're feeding the devil you know it's like that freaking freddy krueger freddy krueger movie you know he feeds off by fear that demon feeds off by fear and there's a demon of fear there's a demon for depression there's a demon for anxiety there's a demon for lust there's a demon for all this stuff but you gotta destroy the temptations of your flesh we desire a lot of messed up stuff but we can also learn from that stuff. We can we can learn not to do it. We can learn to run away from sin. And we can learn when we do sin to get convicted by the Holy Spirit and to never try to never do that again. You know what I mean? Every single day. And it may be hard, but you know, keep picking yourself up, soldier. A righteous man falls seven times or six times, but still gets up seven times. You know, like I think that's how it goes. But anyways, you are special to God, your family is special to God, and you cannot afford to lose this battle. Give your life to Christ now in the name of Jesus, our Father, thou art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us our daily bread, forgive us for our sins, our trespasses, as we forgive those that trespass against us. In the name of Jesus, deliver me not into temptation, but please deliver me from evil. Watch over me throughout all my days in the name of Jesus. Amen. Boom, boom. Give your life to Christ right now. God, say it with me. God, in the name of Jesus, I give my life to you. I receive your Holy Spirit. I love you, God. Thank you for all that you've done for me and for my family, for my ancestors and for my descendants to come. I give my life to you in the name of Jesus. I believe that you did you died on the cross for my sins and resurrected again three days later. Amen. Peace out.